In this lesson, I will show how to use the GeoGebra slope field generator below to graph slope fields for the differential equations y prime equals e to the power of the quantity x minus y, y prime equals x squared, and y prime equals y squared. Going to the slope field generator, by default we have the slope field for dy dx or y prime equals cosine y. Also notice how there's a graph of a particular solution graphed in blue. The red point represents the initial condition. We can click, hold, and drag the red point and the particular solution will change. To turn off the particular solution, click the Solution A box at the bottom. We can change the length of the line segments using the Length slider. We can change the density of the slope field using the Density slider. And we can also change the view by changing the x and y values here. And now let's graph the slope field for y prime equals e to the power of the quantity x minus y. To do this, we click in the y prime box. You can enter the new equation using your computer keyboard or the keyboard provided below. I'm gonna go ahead and use the keyboard below. I'm gonna clear the existing equation and enter y prime equals e, raise the power of open parenthesis, x minus y, close parenthesis, and enter. And now we have the slope field for y prime equals e to the power of the quantity x minus y. If we click on the solution A box, again we can see particular solutions based upon the initial condition given by the red point. And now let's graph the slope field for y prime equals x squared. We go back to the y prime cell clear the existing equation, and simply enter x squared, and enter. And now we have the slope field for y prime equals x squared. And again, if we want to, we can play around with the particular solutions by animating the red point, which represents the initial condition. And finally, we have y prime equals y squared. Click in the y prime box, clear the existing equation, and enter y squared and then enter. And now we have the slope field for y prime equals y squared. I hope you found this helpful.